What's going on guys, I'm here, welcome back to your brand new video on the channel, welcome back to some more Smash Bros Ultimate. It's been like extremely hot today, like it's been fine for the last few weeks. I think at the start of June we had a few very hot days as well, but it's been not too shabby. It's crazy now, I, <laughs> I was walking the dogs just now, it's actually insane. Like it feels like the sun is just ripping off my skin, off my body literally. And I thought it was bad inside, but it's actually just crazy. <laughs> I don't think I've had a proper clip with Peach since I came back to this game here a few few weeks ago, right? I, I don't think I've had any clips yet. But yes, to be fair, I've never really been the best when it comes to dealing with heat, honestly. Like, I remember going to the USA back in, like, 2013 and not even, like, five minutes after we walked out of, like, the airport, right, where there's still air conditioning. Oh, like, the amount of sweat that was on my body sitting in the car right there in the car park. And after literally a few minutes, I was literally dripping with sweat. And back then, I virtually had, like, no hair on my body whatsoever. Like, right now, if I go to the USA right now, especially with global warming, to the same place I went back then, I'm gonna freaking die. Dude. At that point, <laughs> I can't deal with that. Yeah, I've always been more of a fan of just sitting in the shadows and just, you know, making sure I don't overheat by any means, drinking a lot of water and stuff, right? Making sure. Yeah, but that's kind of annoying about walking the dogs right now next to the heat. Like, where I walk the dogs is a very narrow part. Off, where you can walk on then it's like nature all around it so it's nice for the dogs themselves but and i'm not sure what's exactly happening but there's some kind of construction going on around where i walk the dogs so now everyone who wants to just drive their bicycles they have to like take a shortcut through the walk-in place and let me just tell you that place is not designed for any vehicle other than your legs really so you get people driving their vehicle you know, fast. And it would be fine, obviously, if they just, you know, got off their bicycle as soon as they come up to you. But no, hey. <laughs> they expect you to go out of the way when you're walking. It's just crazy. I, I can't. And again, especially with my dog, Lino, he's so scared of everything. I have to, like, keep him on a leash. He, oh, he goes crazy with those bicycles, man. He's, like, scared out of his mind there. Oh, come on, dude. I, I want to get, like, some kind of turnip setup into something I've never had before. Like, some, some kind of shenanigans. I'm not sure what I'm looking for. That's kind of my problem right now. I'm, I'm just doing random stuff. I'm not going for any specific clips. Usually that kind of works. You get, you know, cool setups eventually. But if you don't know what you're doing in the first place, then it's quite hard to get the right conversions. And again, because it's blocked off, they kind of have to go on the path where people walk their dogs. And I mean, the place is literally designed for people to walk their dogs as well. There's, like, signs up there where it's literally specified for people... They just want to walk there. <laughs> and the alternative route is to kind of go all the way around. It's like a long cut, right? You gotta just drive. I think it takes like five minutes longer to go around it instead of going through the, again, walking place. But I mean, come on, man. It's just, it's so annoying, dude. And it's, again, it's not just one. It's like a whole horde of bikers. Or I mean, people on their bicycles, right? It's like continuous. People driving. Being a rude piece of shit. Not stopping or anything. Just expecting you to move around. It's, ah, oh, where's the manners at, man? I, I can't. <laughs> oh, come on. Okay. I could have finished it, dude. I messed it up. Oh, that's what I mean. I'm not sure what I want to go for, so I'm just kind of freestyling it almost, and it can work. It can create some very beautiful organic clips, but it's just so hard to get the right moments. So everything is gonna line up, and you're just pressing buttons as well, so it's very hard to kind of set that up then. Check. Uh. Ah, <laughs> okay. <laughs> it's fun though. Playing against Ganondorf heavyweights overall, it's always interesting. The bigger hitbox combined with like the slower moves they got, it's always very... I don't want to say easy, but you have more options to go for different kind of clips then. You know, different conversions that wouldn't work on other characters that are smaller or faster. Also, by the time you're actually watching this, I should be going live on Twitch, so by all means, check that out. I do kind of want to start a little bit later today, as again, it's extremely hot outside and I'm already dying recording this video, I don't want to be stuck in my room. I want to kind of wait until the sun goes down a little bit so that it, it kind of cools off just a smudge and I can, uh, you know, just survive. I'm not sure why it's been taking so long to find a match either, actually. I'm not quite sure what that's all about. There you go. Maybe me losing every single match kind of ruins the algorithm. I have no idea. Oh. Keep it going. Oh, <laughs> if that hit right there, that would have been so insane, dude. I could have done like a forwarder or something. Finish it off like very nicely. This guy keeps approaching, dude. Oh my god, I, I, I can't hit clips on this. Yeah, it's too laggy for it as well, you know. It's very rough then to get your right moves out on the right times. 
I do think it's gonna do it here for this video. A few matches, right? I don't want to record for too long here, as again, it's very, very hot outside, so I want to call it short. Thank you guys so much for watching. Tune into the stream, of course. I'll be playing some more Record Weave, probably. Maybe some Smash Ultimate 2 later on. I'll see how it goes, but thank you guys so much for watching again. And I'll see you guys in the next episode. Enjoy your stay.